Hey, how's it going? Good to have you back and welcome to the Live Another Life series and the Thieves Guild under new management quest. This is where we finally become the Guildmaster. Uh, but get to get to that lofty position, we've got a hell of a lot of work to do. So let's crack on. Okay, so here we are at the Thieves Guild. Now, I've decided to do this as one long video um, rather than break it up into several parts. So uh, I hope you like this format. Uh, and trust me, it took a lot longer than the hour this video is going to be. So to begin with, what we've got to do is go and see Delvin and Vex. Now, what we've got to do is five small jobs in each of the holds. And once five jobs, small jobs in the hold has been completed, we can then do a special job. Need some gold. Well, they have some okay. work for you. So what I'm going to do is going to show you all the different types of jobs that you can do, and you can Before choose which ones you like. You actually got your hands on it. So we're going to flog him back to the eye of the Falmer. Now bear in mind, you do get that back once you become Guildmaster. It's put behind his desk, and it's yours to keep. There you go. You earned it. Okay, right. Lucky is all. Bumped into someone Need some gold. Someone else. Well, they have some work for you. And lose out just when the going is getting good? No thanks. I handle the fishing, numbers... And so you just ask him if he's got any extra work. Okay, and he handles three times the jobs, and uh, I'll get him to explain them. Tell me about the number jobs. Most of the establishments in Skyrim keep their transactions recorded within business ledgers. Your job will be to change the numbers in those books so the shortfalls from our other jobs look legit. We'll like doing a bit of writing. Old, bloody good timing. Okay, and then... Clients. These are about the fishing jobs. There are all sorts of people wandering around carrying their valuables on their person, just waiting for someone like you to pick their pocket. So, you in for a little fishing? So jobs available. Bloody good time. Okay, so let's take Just a quick look at the bedlam jobs. Sometimes we just like to remind the city that we mean business, so we hit them hard. Just steal whatever we can until we made an impression. Simple, right? Almost. The catch is, it doesn't count if anyone sees you take it. The message needs to be clear. We work in the shadows. Steal from anywhere in the hold. And you even get to keep everything you stole. So, you in. Okay, you'll no, take it now. Right He'll give you. you a job. Now, the I'll thing is, you don't take any jobs in Riften. They don't count towards your overall progress. It's White Run, Solitude, Windhelm, um, Mark Arthur, etc. Okay? So, if you get one in, in Riftum, you quick save, just, just go back to a load and ask him again. Okay, the same goes for uh, Vex. We'll have a little look at the, little, <laughs> a little look at the jobs that she offers. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up-close and personal jobs. Tell me about the burglary jobs. Pretty simple. Break into a house, grab a specific item, and get out before they realize what's going on. The catch is you can't kill anyone who lives there, or you forfeit the payment. You ready for some good old-fashioned burglary? Tell me about the shield jobs. When a client needs us to eliminate another, we don't operate like the Dark Brotherhood. We find alternate means to get them out of the way. We send you to plant some phony evidence in the Mark's house and then tip off the town guard. The rest takes care of itself. Sound like you can handle it? Tell me about the one sweet jobs. One of the quickest jobs. ways to make some coin in Skyrim is to clear out some of the wealthier homes of their valuables. If you're interested, I could point out a good place that could use a little house cleaning. What do you say? Will it be? Okay, and finally, tell me about the heist jobs. Every now and again, we like to remind the shopkeepers that we're in charge. If that means breaking into their strong boxes and stealing something valuable from them, then so be it. Feel like doing a bit of shopping? 
the guild way? Okay, so now the way I always do this, I always do a tally well, gate. Uh, that's where you use sticks and turn them into right four there. sticks and a cross diagonal, so you've done the five jobs. The uh, hard it's save, uh, sorry, quick save before you take a job, question. and you work your way through. It will take longer years. towards the end because, say, you've done four, four in uh, White Run um, and Windhelm, and you're looking for the Solitude one, so you have to keep on reloading until they come up. Uh, but trust me, uh, that's the best way to do it because you can easily lose track. Uh, sorry if I'm teaching some of you to uh, suck eggs, but uh, a lot of people get confused by this small jobs thing uh, here. Okay, and again, none in Riften. Okay, so the first one uh, is in White Run. This is a special job. We, we completed all the small jobs. Okay, let's pop over to White Run, and we go and see this chap. Alfred, patron of the great clan, your Delvin Mallory sent me. A moment too soon. If anything should happen to Arn, there'll be hell to pay. A close Calm down, who's Arn? We fought together on the battlefield for many years until old age got the better of us. Now it's up to me to save him one more time. This time from the executioner's block in solitude. Solitude? Why am I here in White Run? Is seeking on for a serious crime. When he fled here, he was arrested for drunken behavior. Can you imagine? Fortunately, his identity isn't known to the authorities in White Run, so there's still a chance to save him. Alright, just point me to the prisons. This is more than a simple prison break. I want to have Arn's name stricken from the record books permanently. I'm setting him up with a new identity. It's the only way to throw the guard permanently off his trail. So what's the, the job? job? Is twofold. First, steal a letter that was sent from Solitude warning White Run's guard to be on the lookout for Arn. The second is to change Arn's name in the prison registry to his new identity. Sounds easy. If it was easy, I would have hired a local thumb instead of a professional. You see, both of these items are kept inside Dragon's Reach. And they don't allow visitors inside the Jarls or the Steward's Chambers. One more thing. If you get caught, I can't afford to be connected to you. Remember that before you do anything stupid. Okay. Watch right. Let's go. Yes, I'm listening. I think we get these two uh, reprobates to okay. wait here. Stay I here, guess girl. I'll wait a while, but I'm not waiting forever. You have something to say? Stay here, my furry little friend. Whistle if you need me, okay? Sure thing, dude. Right, let's go. This is where going the illusion uh, side is. It makes uh, these jobs so much easier. I probably don't need to use a muffled spell. I've already got muffled boots on, so. Anyway, we just get this done as quick as we can. Yeah, like I say, when you're doing the four, the uh, five small jobs, yeah, do keep a tally. It's so easy to get lost. So, so easy. Okay. Okay, that part's done. <laughs> That's a bit creepy. I haven't been seeing the uh the bar's flat 
But she's definitely watching. She's definitely watching me. Okay. Come on, bugger off. Ooh. I'll come back for that. I'll save that one. Okay, so back Alfred. to Alfred. Arn. Everything's Never been done. Heard. Arn should be safe. I guess that means you're finished. Here's your payment. Tell Delvin that he has my support and all the weight it carries in Whiterun from now on. I think he'll be quite pleased. Watch yourself out there. Okay, right. Let's go and see uh, Delvin again. Finish that special uh, white run job. Alfred sent ahead his compliments. Looks like his friend Arn is soon to be released, thanks to his brand new identity. More importantly, he's pledged the full support of the Battleborn clan to the Thieves Guild. I think you'll find that the guild is beginning to grow. We've had a merchant moving into space right outside the flagon. It's nice to shake off the cobwebs and get things rolling again. Keep this up, and I can see a bounty headed our way. Something troubling you? I'll listen. Okay, I've completed the numbers sure job. See. Well done. Have something special for I've me? I've got another special request, and I specifically ask for you. You're making a name for yourself, that's for sure. But more important, you're making a name for the guild. Keep it up. Got so what's a special the request? The rival guild is trying to get itself started. Not only that, but they're giving us thieves about So as you can see, we've done the um, the five small jobs in Windhelm and now we've got the special job there. Okay, right. Okay, this is actually quite a good one. Uh, but I'm not going to do this with any finesse. I'm just going to go in and get it done. My own Hollyfrost farm Delvin Manroy said you had a job for me. It's honest work, if a bit dull. My daughter right. Philippe. Right. She was murdered a few months ago. Left her laying on the ground in a pool of her own blood. I assumed they were after her valuables. She always wore far too much jewellery in public. And I told her it'd be the death of her. I never thought. I sure you wasn't no anyone from the guild. I'm well aware of your guild's methods. It took me weeks, but I finally tracked down to kill her. A bloody Altmer at that. Can you imagine? What happened to him? Let's just say I'm a firm believer in an eye for an eye and leave it at that. He fancied himself a thief in some sort of new guild forming around here. Gave me some valuable information before. Well, you know. What well, exactly do you, like you, you need me to do then? We can help each other. You recover what I'm looking for, and take out a rival guild in the process. Exactly. It's... One of the pieces stolen from her was a silver locket, a cruel sea family heirloom. I want it back. Deal. Where do I, I begin? There's a house right here in Windhelm. That's where you should begin looking. You could have been an adventurer like you instead of a farmer. Yeah, you should have, mate. Right, okay. She's a tall girl. They're strapping Lord Lasses, aren't it's they? so cool that it makes White Run seem like a tropical paradise. Not to mention the people here seem very bitter. Okay, I want to avoid that if I can. Right. I don't want to get pulled into that uh, that quest just yet. Okay. I don't like the city. Okay, here she is, Naranyi. I think her name is. I'm here about Fiolti. Oh, Fiolti. Sorry. Where have I heard that name? Oh, of course, the poor girl who was murdered. Such a beautiful young thing. A tragedy to be certain. 
Drop the axe. I know you're involved How in her death. You. You're accusing me of taking part in such a, such a heinous act? I should have you arrested for even suggesting such a thing. I'm afraid I have absolutely no idea what you're speaking of. Okay, that never works. Tell me everything or I'm end up like Fialty. No idea what you're speaking of. Oh, wrong bloody now, one. Just a moment. Let's there you go. Think about this, you know, discuss it like two rational people. I'm listening. Look, I had no choice. They're crazy. I could be killed. Who's crazy? It's a guild of Ultima thieves. They call themselves the Somerset Shadows. Their leader, Linway, is the worst of the lot. He steals valuables from the dead. No, you mean he murders Linway his marks? Stealing from the deceased, digs up the corpses, breaks into the hall of the dead. He even stole that locket right off that poor murdered girl's body, or what was left of it. How'd you get involved? I used to guild in Skyrim a long time ago. When Linway moved into the area, he contacted me and said if I didn't fence for them, he'd kill me. If I tell you, tell me where Linway's hiding. Me, I'd prove to be quite an asset to the Thieves Guild. I'm one of the best fences in Skyrim. I'm not going to kill you. Linway That's not our way. A place called Uttering Hills Cave. He's got his entire guild there, so be careful. After you're done with all this, come back any time and I'll, I'll make good on my end of the bargain. Okay, so let's go and see this Linwee chap and there he is, just there. Okay, so I haven't been there. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll edit all this out. I'll fast travel to the stables and then we go from there. Okay, we're nearly there. So, I should just said something occurred to me. Oh, God, hello. Yeah, it's pretty good, mate. You're dead. Yeah, or well, maybe Linway didn't murder the girl. He was, she was killed by the, uh, the mass murderer in Windhelm, and he just stole her locket. Because I'd always assumed he was a killer. There you go. So, who knows? And the good thing about these is you get a load of uh, Thieves Guild armour, which is unenchanted. So it's fairly decent, um, nice armour. Though, let's be honest, there is better. But still, it's good to have. Especially at this stage of the game as well. Right now, normally I'll go in being very subtle, but uh, I want to get this uh, quest done. So I have a quick look around here and then I'm going for a dash and bash. I hope you have a backup plan if we get caught. No, I don't. I'm still woefully underpowered at the moment. Okay, oh, we've been cornholed. Damn it, I'm out of magic now. Yeah, I'll take all this armor. Actually, Lidway's armor is almost quite good. That's definitely worth having. Okay. 
me. All right, let's go for it. Oh, nice one. <laughs> Oh, that's not bad. Oh, that's handy. Okay, I think that's the other way you can come in, if I remember rightly. Okay, and... Get away, Sophia. Which way to go? Oh, there you go. Down here. Come on, Magic. Huh? Oh, no, they should be dealing with it fairly well. Okay. Oh, decapitated. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, I bet that hurt. Oh, that's Limway. I didn't know that was Limway. Okay, well, got the locket. Glass off. Good, good. Hunting mode. Don't need that, really. Okay. Limway's boots. Sneaking is 15% better. That's good. Bows with 15% more damage. That's good. One hand attacks to 15% and increase your stamina by 15 points. So that's interesting. His armor is actually probably more combat based than uh, thief base. That's interesting. So that's decent armor actually at a, an early stage. Okay, what have we got here? Potion alteration, that's good. I didn't realize that was uh, Linway. If you dare let one go, then you could forget me helping you. Why am I even talking? Oh, chest. Garnet gold. Okay, nom de nom. I tell you, you make so much gold during this thieves uh, uh, quest as well. A lot of gold. Oh, damn it, miss. There you go. Okay, so that's the option. We destroyed their uh, banner to leave our mark. Oh, wait, that's good. Yeah, I'll read that. I'm not coming back here, so uh, yeah, I'll read that. Oh, chess. Okay, look in here first. No. What you got? Boss chess. Glass war axe, gold. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that's good. I think we're pretty much done here. Oh, 
Oh, I'm sure there's a way. I can't remember what it is. I can't remember which way it is. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's not part of what we're doing today, so we don't care. Okay, we might care a little bit. Okay, we do care. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. I've got something I got in my head. There was uh, last time I come down here, something was happening over there. I can't remember. It doesn't matter. I didn't realise it was so long. Or have we come out of a different place? I don't think we have. Okay, so we head back and uh, speak to Torsten. A Fjotli's locket. To be reminded of Fiotli once more, but I'm glad it's back. Fiotli, sorry. Tell Delvin that if he still desires to have my support for the Thieves Guild in Windhelm, he's got it. <laughs> Should have been in a... Okay, so go back to Delvin. I finished that special George Windhelm was job. Gratified, the death of his daughter was avenged, and the heirloom was returned. At this very moment. He's laying the groundwork for the guild to re-establish itself in Windhelm. Burning that banner was a nice touch too. Should send a clear message to the Somerset Shadows that we're a force to be reckoned with. We're still growing by leaps and bounds thanks to you. And other merchants moved into the space outside the flagon. You're a natural. Never seen anything like it. We got a long way to go. But don't let that bother you. It's a lot farther than we've been in years. Okay, so I've done the uh, five jobs in Good solitude, job. so now, I've completed the last one, completed the numbers job. Have something special for me, Delvin? What you're made of, but I've never seen anyone tackle this many jobs without ending up dead or in jail. We got half of Skyrim back under our wing, and the coins starting to flow. Ah, there, that's if good. You're ready? I've got another special job for you. So what's the special request? I need you to make your way to Solitude and talk to Erica. He's looking to run some kind of a shield job. Now, he's not exactly going to welcome you with open arms, but keep you cool. Do this job right, and we've just made an important friend out there. Okay, right, let's pop over to Solitude. Okay. Blue Palace. Go and get out of the way, girl. The Imperials are good for business, and business is good Delvin for Delvin Manoway said you have work for me. It's about time you got here. I'm not accustomed to dealing with people who are unreliable. That's why I asked Delvin to send me his best. Huh. That's why he sent me. Nothing raises my ire more than having an agreement broken. It's bad for business and it wastes time. Captain Volf of the Dainty Slode has decided to test my patience on this matter by neglecting to honor a trade agreement we had established. 
I assume this is where I enter the picture. I need picture. you to help me show him the error of his ways by sneaking on board the slowed and planting some contraband. What sort of You'll contraband? You need to get your hands on some Belmora Blue from Sabine Niet down by the docks. She's the first mate on another ship, the Red Wave. Once you get your hands on it, I want you to plant it in Captain Bolf's footlocker. I'll take care of the rest. Captain Consider Bolf it done. Sure, right now, and I want the authorities waiting for him when he gets back. Now get going. I don't want to see your face until the job's done. He's a lovely chap, isn't he? Good. We wasted enough time here. <laughs> Right, okay. Okay, two ways you can do is you can buy the uh, the stuff off the first mate, or you can just jump down here somewhere and swim along. There's a chest underneath the pier here. And make sure you don't drown. Okay, somewhere down here. Okay, come up for air a little bit. And I think it's on the inside. Just go on the inside here. Oh, there it is. There's the chest. And it's an expert lock, so uh, quick save before you do it if you're not confident. And for those of you basically aren't confident with lock picking, I've done a uh, guide on lock picking for you. So have a look, look, look at that. It does make it look a lot easier. Oh, nearly there, nearly there. All oh, wrong way. Give it a tweak. That's it, job done. And Balmora Blue. Okay. Now another way of doing it is to pickpocket this person. Okay, make sure you quick save as well. Okay, so we've got his key. And there's a dainty shod, and I think we've been. Yeah, we go there. And I'm going to have to do this in a sneaky, sneaky way. Damn it, he saw me. Damn it, he saw me. Where are you? Quickly. Quickly. Hide from me. Huh? Where's he gone? Oh, don't touch me. There you go. I'll just hide up here till he calms down. Hide from me. I can, and I am. God bless the invisibility spell. Okay, that's okay. Right, I haven't got any extra bounties. That's cool. He's got a curved sword. A curved sword. Ooh.
I find it always unnerving when they just stand there staring at me, even when, even when I'm uh, invisible. Okay, okay, well, we'll do this, laser, and... There's a stone of Baron Zaya, I think, uh, on the desk up here. And you can get it without go killing him. Okay, right. Okay, I did pick it up, didn't I? Oh, that's weird. Am I going bonkers? I did pick it. I did, I'm sure I picked it up. It's not impatient. It's not miscellaneous. Oh, there you go. Ah, it's in food. There you go. What a bug. What an absolute burk. Okay. Turns to Blue Palace. Natural magics are coming from that cave. There are the are good for business and business is I planted good the inspired. contraband on the dainty slowed. Yes, I know. In fact, by now, Captain Wolf should be on his way to the prison. Our contract is complete. Your eminence. Here's a token of my gratitude for your efforts. Is under oh, convey my compliments to Delvin for me. Tell him I'll be happy to reopen whatever doors he needs in solitude. Really? Sparks? Thank you. Okay, let's go and see uh, Delvin. Got lots of jobs available. I finished that special Erica job. Assures me that Captain Wolf will spend pretty much the rest of his life clamped in irons. Best of all, he's also pledged to open doors for us in solitude and to get things rolling again. Success means the guild is getting stronger. We've picked up another merchant and a new recruit. Being a thief is like a second skin for you, ain't it? Never seen anything like it. If yeah, you thank you very much. Out, you might even earn Vex's respect. That'd have me sunny gate. I do for you today. Couldn't have done it better myself. Okay, I think it's the last one. I've completed the numbers job. Anything special for me, Delvin? Well, I never thought I'd see the guild this way ever again. A place is growing into what it used to be when Gallus was running the show. Contacts are springing up all over. And I've got young footpads beating down the door to join up. I've got one last special request of you. Finish this one, and all of Skyrim's ours for the taking. So what's his special request? I want you to head out to Markov and speak to Endon. He's a silversmith. He has some kind of shop there. His father was a good friend of the guild back in the day. But we could really use his family's influence back on our side. Okay, yeah, I think this is one of the, uh, the, the best quests in, in, in the... Or, or side quests here. In this particular um, Become Guildmaster. I work silver. Storyline. Delvin Manroy oh, sent me. Goodness. I wasn't sure where else to turn. To start from Several the beginning. Several months ago, I ordered a special silver mold from some artisans in Valenwood by way of a Khajiit caravan. Well, it never arrived. Later, I found out that it was robbed by a group of bandits led by someone named Regal Strongarm. Mm -hmm. Look, I talked to the Jarl, the steward, the housecarl, everyone. 
They all told me their resources were spread too thin right now. Word on the street says that the Thieves' Guild is coming back into its own in Markarth. So I figured... Send the Thieves exactly. still back what was stolen. Look, this mold is irreplaceable. I'll pay you well for its return. And I can also prove to be quite a valuable ally to the Thieves' Guild. No time yes, to lose indeed. then. The only thing I can tell you is that the mold was taken to the bandit's hideout, a small cottage called Pine Watch. I'm Ooh, not sure been how there. many men they have inside, but I trust that won't be an issue for you. Good luck. I have silver to bend. Fair enough. Okay, to so Pine Watch, and uh, yeah, we have been here it's right outside where Lakeview Man is going to be, which hopefully will be my ultimate player home. Okay, uh, again, I'm just going to dash and bash this one. No subtlety at all. So I'll bring Sophia and Inigo with me. Good couple of little tanks actually. Okay, is there anything worth nicking up here? I am in your way. I am sorry. Good night. <laughs> Gold. Okay. And let's see what else they got around here. All coin purse. Okay. Right, so I was there robbing people as they're coming down the road, so uh, these are nasty people. And we're slightly less nasty. Come on, where's the gold? I can't resist it. Come on, where's that gold? I know it's there. There you go. Just double check there's nothing around here. Okay, right. Let's activate the button. Kicks them all down the stairs. That'd be a nice little warning for anybody down here. Nom nom. I hope you have a backup plan if we get caught. Away, goodness sake. Ah, damn it, I'm carrying too much. Let's drop something. Uh, what don't I need? Oh, Iron War Axe, that can go. That's one I want to drop. There you go. Okay, I'll do a bit of trading with these guys. Was there something you wanted? Let's just dump a whole heap of stuff on her. I have to trade some well, some things with you, girl. Okay, but only because it's you. Okay, let's dump all this stuff. Oh, there we go. Oh, scimitar. Yeah, I'll give her that actually. See if she uses it, that'd be interesting. I might give um, Inigo one as well. A 
Actually, Linway's arm is, arm is quite good, so I'll, I'll dump all these on it. Okay, I'm still not sure what that is. I'm glad that's sorted. Okay, so we're good to go. Because we will be picking up a bit of loot here. And I'm not sure if I remember rightly where we go. But we'll find our way. Oh, these are obviously the people they've uh, they've been robbing. I'm sure, by the way, there's going to be loose I'm missing. I'm not particularly looking for it. Okay, back up the stairs in. Oh yeah, this way. Ooh. And good night. That's it, an expert log. Good night. Oh, I'll take that. Oh, I'm dagger. That's good. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, sorry, sorry, in you go. <laughs> That's not bad, Lou. Okay, right, where are we? Oh, we've been turned around, haven't I? Where the hell am I? Ah, there it is.
And job done. Okay, right, so I'll turn myself around. Where am I? Okay, right, there's the body, so it's this way. Okay, right. Got to head downwards. There you go, this is the way. There you go. God, it's so easy to get turned around in here. Oops, didn't see it. Come get out of the way, Sophia. Oh, okay. Okay, that's quick and effective. Letter from Come on, it won't be that bad. Reagan may be paranoid, but she's as dumb as a mammoth, body hair like one too. I'm just saying if we can get into that treasure room. We'd be set. We could just take the money and head north to catch a ship. I know a guy who's cousin, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so it looks like they're going to go after the, uh, the plotting behind the bandit leader's back. Okay, we've got that. Don't care. Okay. Which pale hood? Oh, that's from an armor mod I've got on. Go for a little pick. Okay. That's pretty crap. Go, then you could forget me helping you. <laughs> Why am I even talking? I don't know. I wish you'd shut up. Oh, on which way are we going? God, I'm getting turned around left, right, and bloody centre in this one. Okay, right, it's got to be up here. Ah, there it is. God, I went right past it. What a doofus.
Oh, Droga. Actually, the collateral damage off these um, these spells from Creation Club is quite a lot. Okay, lots of Droga. Nommy nom. Hit him with a bomb, basically. Not exactly particularly stealthy, is it? Oh, thief backpack. Yeah, I'll take that. Anything up here? Sea dog armor. Okay, let's do a bit of looting. Oh no, I don't want to sit on that bench. Butterfingers. Okay, I'm taking them nom not pick. Bosma curious. Oh that looks quite nice. Yeah, I'll take those. I am not feeling at my best. It is a good thing I heal quickly. It's probably because I've been blowing you up. A bit of blue on blue, pal. I apologise. Okay, that's what these guys have got. Okay, we're getting there slowly. Oh, well done, guys. Okay, right. And good night. Oh, take that, yep. Pine watch key, pine treasure key. Okay, all right. Oh, gold. Oh.
quite an interesting little barrow this one okay watch the traps I've got that perk where I don't set them off you may not have it so uh, be careful ah oh, crap I know what this is oh no okay that's good And there's the uh, never work on a farm. They are always full of tools and hoes. Those hoes are a real pain to use. Never again will I do an honest day's work. Oh, take like that. So the loot you get off this job is actually really good. In fact, just doing the Thieves Guild quest it honestly gives you so much coin. Uh, and especially when we... Uh, I'll show you exactly what you get for uh, becoming Guildmaster, by the way. And effectively it means you don't have to worry about uh, gold at all for the rest of the game. So, it's really decent. Okay, anything else around here? Oh, that's good. Okay, guys, we're nearly there. Nearly there. So let's just get the head out of here and go back. Yeah, I think it's this way. There you go. Yeah. There you go. On a way out. Yeah, I don't think I've been turned around in the barrow so many times as this one. Don't know why it kept on throwing me. Okay. And back to Thieves Guild. Oh, sorry, Markarth uh, first. What am I talking about? Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. I work silver, like my father. You've more than proven that the Thieves Guild is back on its feet in our city and earned every bit of your reward. Tell Delvin that he can count on me to provide the influence around here with the right people when he needs it. If you're ever looking to sell any illegally obtained merchandise, I'd also provide my services as a fence. It's the least I can do. Oh, thank you very much. Leather armor of minor restoration. Fantastic. Okay, so let's head back. This has been a long old haul, by the way. I've got this down to what, just over an hour in video. This has taken me hours to do. That was, <laughs> but it is definitely worth it. Okay. Right, let's go and see Delvin first. Or do we talk to him? Oh, there's Delvin there. Okay, so we're supposed to bring you off first. Well, my friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guild master. Don't worry, I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of this cistern room, we can begin. Okay, let's take this long walk. I'll bring you off, doesn't actually like walking. Uh very fast so but I have noticed sometimes when I run ahead of them uh, it glitches the quest out so I tend to uh, just slow walk with them 
Even though it dries up the bloody wall. Have you seen the uh, mod I put on? How, how dramatically it improves the uh, the cistern and the red flag and um, as, as you progress through this quest and the guild gets richer and there's more opulence around the uh, well, the area. It was pretty good now actually. I'm just gonna keep it short. Being guild master means more than just getting a cut of all the loot. It's about being a leader and keeping this rabble in order. With that in mind, I propose that the position of guild master should be yours. Delvin. Agree. Vex. Sure. Why not? Carlia. Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you Guildmaster. I wish you good fortune and long life. Now everyone, get back to work. Okay, come here, bring off. Come here. Come here. You need anything, anything at all. Don't hesitate to ask. So that's it. Nothing else to it. Well, that's it. Sorry if it isn't the ceremony you were hoping for, but we're not exactly known for throwing our coin around. After we're done, head over to Tanelia. She'll set you up with your guild master armor. Oh, and one last thing. Here, I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. Okay, so you get the Amulet of Articulation, um, you get a key, there's a chest suddenly appears here, you get a key to that. Uh, the Amulet of Articulation, effectively you'll win any speech argument with it. Really, really definitely worth having. Seriously, definitely worth having. Okay, so that's it, we're now Guildmaster. You're right, Carlo, girl. I can't think of a better person for the job, Nightingale. Uh, about the secret of the Nightingales. Within the guild are well aware of what transpired between Mercer Frey and ourselves. The notion that the Nightingales are a fictive group has long since passed. If you wish to wear your Nightingale armor within the guild, I'm certain that no one would give it a second thought. I'm feeling a sense of inner peace, something I haven't felt in a very long time. Instead of being clouded with thoughts of revenge and retribution, I feel only serenity and Oh, so few do. Of course, <laughs> I've been also damaged in my old pastimes as well. Take a look around, and feel free to share the fruits of my labour. May the shadows guide your journey. Ah, oh, thank you very much. Okay, so Delvin, I think we've got to go and see now. And I think we'll do one last quest to kind of really put this one to bed. Get our armor first. Before we get down to business, I've got something I need you to do. Sure, what do you need? Well, as you know, the guild's growing and things are looking up around here. The only thing we're lacking is a reliable way to transport our merchandise across Skyrim. How can I help? I'm not sure if you've noticed, but there are several Khajiit caravans that travel across the realm. They're shrewd traders and don't mind getting their hands dirty. I've bartered with their leader, Rasad, on more than one occasion. You want me to go and talk Actually, to Rasad? I want you to bring him something. You see, the caravans are notorious for transporting illegal substances. Present Rasad with the satchel of moon sugar, and I bet my last septum he'll make a deal. Okay. Bring off said you had something for me. Yes, and I'm more than happy to give it to you. I mean, look at this place. I've never seen so much wealth down here. You've made us all rich. Here you go. Should fit you like a glove, boss. Yeah, thank you, Cal. You'll find Rasad with his caravan. Just don't do anything stupid when you get there. <laughs> yeah, the boss bit didn't last very long, did it? Right, okay, let's get the uh, look at the Guild Master's armor. Carrying capacity, 35% pickpocketing, that's handy. Lot picking, 35%, that's handy. 
twice as twenty. They're dead handy to carry around. Very handy. Okay, so let's go and chase these guys down. And he's on the road from Markarth. And I don't think I've been anywhere near that, so. She may be from Markarth Stables and run across the, down the river. That's the way we go. Anyway, here they are at long last. You approach as if you know us, stranger. Who are you, and what do you want? I bring an offer yes, from the Thieves' Guild. The Guild is rising back to power. An alliance would be most beneficial to both parties. I will consider the offer, but I'll have to discuss it with the other caravans. Perhaps this will sweeten ah, the deal. Boom, sugar. I could smell it on you. I am pleased with this offer, and accept. <laughs> Take my word to the leaders of your guild and tell them we look forward to a prosperous and profitable future. If you happen upon any of our caravans in your travels, we'd also be more than willing to pay you a fair sum for any of your stolen goods. So that's another fence. So we got a fence in all the holds in Skyrim. Okay, and let's head back. This has been a long old road, this one. Always a pleasure, boss. Okay, I finished that special well, Markarth yeah, job. It's quite pleased to have his merchandise back. He's a powerful ally in Markarth. Should help the guild regain a foothold in the West. Okay, I didn't get anything for that. Nice one. Hello, friend. I struck a deal with Rassad. I'll contact some of my people and have them prepare some shipments right away. Good job. Here, let me give you something for all the legwork. Six hundred. Six hundred. Are you kidding me? I'm Guildmaster. Okay, guys. Uh, look at the gold I've made on this, over 26,000, and I spend a lot of it as well on, on bits and bobs, uh, on buying some certain uh, enchanted items. So there you go, we're Guildmaster. Next video, I'll show you exactly why this quest is probably the best to do early on in the game. It affects, effectively allows you not to bother losing or worry about gold for the rest of the game. And I'll show you why when I show you where to get and find all the thieves caches hope you enjoyed the vid guys catch you later i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like leave a comment and please do subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this then push the bell next to the subscribe button after you subscribe obviously later